All right, new tonight, a group of teens rushed to help save a man in the Chestnut Hill Reservoir. But this particular rescue has a twist. Our Michael Rosenfield joins us live from Chestnut Hill now with a story you will see only right here on NBC10 Boston. Michael. Phil, the rescue leading to a little bit of a surprise for some Orthodox Jewish high school students. It's a moment they likely won't soon forget, and neither will the police officer who was here at the scene. It was late at night, and the group of Jewish teens were on a walk around the Chestnut Hill Reservoir, and Officer Carl Mascholi was on patrol. As I approached them, two of them ran up to my car to tell me that there was, there was a body in the water. The Boston College police officer ran down the embankment and found a man partially submerged and not moving. While I was pulling him out of the water, I, I also observed that, I, that he had a swastika on his hand. Turned out the man the Jewish boys helped save had a tattoo of the Nazi symbol. I had kind of let the gentleman know sometimes some deeds have a funny way of turning around. and the, Their good deed actually kind of uh, had a little, little bit of a twist to it. The students who study at a yeshiva high school in Brighton were not permitted to speak with us about the incident, but they did have one message for the officer to share with the man they helped rescue. They wanted just to let them know that, uh, that, that he should know that it was four young Jewish boys that helped, helped save his life. We're told the students had no regrets about helping a man with an anti-Semitic tattoo. A good deed is a good deed, and you know, in that, in that part, of, part of life, you know, we should be helping everybody out. It's unclear exactly how the man ended up in the water, but police say he did not have much time left. He is expected to recover. We're live in Chestnut Hill tonight. Michael Rosenfield, NBC10 Boston.